Yo, can you believe that I've never seen a Robert Pattinson movie? Like before this reaction started, I went to IMBD to see if I had seen any of his movies and I haven't seen anything. I have not seen one thing this dude is in. I haven't seen Twilight, which would actually probably make for some pretty funny content, like struggling through Twilight for the first time. I would never do that unless you guys wanted me to react to it, then I would do it. But I've never seen Robert Pattinson in action. Very first movie I see by the dude is The Batman. And before we get too far into it, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Alex and today we're checking out The Batman. Don't believe the lies to see. I pretty much said everything that I needed to say before the intro music played, so there's not much to say now. Let's go. Oh boy. What the hell? Starting off with a peeping Tom. Oh God. What the hell is happening? <laughs> The Salvatore Moroni case was the biggest drug bust in city history. Listen, I have a beautiful wife. Shit, I thought that was something in my house. Yeah, she's Fuck. We need a leader, Mr. Mitchell, not a cheerleader. Oh. Tell the people the truth. Stop shaking your Willis and your pom-poms around. It's not gonna do anything. Oh! Dear God, it seemed like a very inefficient, like, I guess it was pretty efficient, <laughs> but just seemed like a non-graceful way to attack someone. <laughs> I don't know why I'm judging the level of grace in people's attacks against others. I don't know. What the hell? I don't even know, like, what villain is in this movie. Who is this? October 31st. Halloween, AKA Pumpkin Day. No one calls it that. Hidden in the chaos is the element that I'm there too, watching. Two years of nights turned me into a nocturnal animal. Yeah, bat, dude. Fucking Batman. I must choose my targets carefully. What the hell is dude dressed up as a Brussels sprout? Come on, give me the money. I know I'm a sprout, but I'm about to turn you to a vegetable. We have a signal now for when I'm needed. It's not just a call, it's a warning to them. Well, yeah, no shit. Dude looks like an off-brand airhead running around. I'd be scared, too. They think I'm hiding in the shadows. Dude, this is such an epic build-up. This intro right now is so cool. It's not gonna be Batman, is it? Walking too damn slow. I feel like it's gonna be some fucking small little Boy Scout. Okay, nope, that is Batman. The hell are you supposed to be? I'm vengeance. Oh shit. Which one of you sissy mamas wants my coupon book now? What? <laughs> Damn, tased them out. Paying homage to the Joker, right, in Dark Knight? With all that face paint like that? Gotta be. Whoa, 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 whoa. Police action. He's with me, officer. Goddamn freak. Why you gotta say that? Arguably, you're the freak. You're five foot four with a gazpacho mustache. No more lies. Excuse me. <laughs> Pardon me, Mr. Batman. Echimosis. Around the wound. Interesting hearing Batman that doesn't sound like this color. Lacerations around the wound. I'm not expecting Batman. He said there was a card. Wait, a card? Okay, so it's the Joker, right? No. Let's play a game, just me and you. Oh, the Riddler. Oh. What does a liar do when he's dead? Lies? Like, lies down? He lies still. Ah. Uh, for some dark, twisted murder humor? That's not bad. That's not bad. Was there anyone else in the house when you uh, so if it's the same origin story, you know Batman identifies super hard with that kid. Definitely sees himself in that little boy. Sounds borderline disgusting and inappropriate. A wife lost a husband. And I lost a friend. Oh, uh, this is a cool soundtrack. Mayor, Mit Mayor Mitchell was a fighter for the city. And I will not rest until this killer is found. Something in the way. The city's eating itself. 
Got super intense Daredevil vibes. Or I guess Daredevil has Batman vibes. Gotham, Hell's Kitchen, Masked Vigilante. Very similar. I love the slow fucking like heroin music type of vibe. Really adds like a moody texture to it, you know? I have to force myself to remember everything that happened. Whoa. 20 years ago this week, a celebrated billionaire philanthropist Dr. Thomas Wayne and his wife Martha were slain during Wayne's own mayoral campaign. Dude looks like he's in a punk band. I don't care about that. Any of that. You don't care about your family's legacy? <laughs> no. No. I don't care what happens to me. That's all I'm afraid of. Alfred, stop. You're not my father. Oh, that's Alfred. Why did not I put that together? I'm used to Alfred being in tall, white, slick back hair, dude. This is edgy, bro. Some fresh berries there. It's not what I would expect in a setting like that. Very dark, castle-like. Yeah, here's some bright red berries. Enjoy. I'd expect some caviar and some whiskey. Drive? Fuck. I guess it's good to be the mayor. What are we looking for? USB port. Why would you be looking for a USB port? Thumb drive. Oh. Jesus. Oh, shit. We're using body parts in there, dude. Oh, this guy's hilarious. <laughs> God, that is fucked up. Oh, shit. No idea. But that's the penguin. Carmine Falcone's right hand. I know who he is. That's the Iceberg Lounge. Is she, is she, she's, that girl got hit. Never get in there without a warrant. No, I am. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I got an idea. Why the hell would someone not know who you are if you're dressed up as Batman, dude? You're in the night sky. Get out of here, freak. The little suit's gonna get all full of blood. Yeah, your blood. Mine or yours. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that was easy. Fucking scissor slap both of them and just walk on by. I wonder how many people down below would look up and be like, oh look, entertainment. They're smacking each other with fucking poles, shooting guns, cool. Hey Tammy, can you get me another drink? Oh, whoa, 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 take it easy, sweetheart. You looking for me? Who is she? I really don't know, Chief. <laughs> Batman got chiefed. It's okay, baby. It's the vengeance here, yeah. You don't bite. You look like you're pure edge as well. Wait, is that her? I can't tell. I want to know who she is and what she has to do with this murder. Who's Mida? The mayor's. Oh shit, it is. Look at that. <laughs> don't let me hurt you. You know my reputation. I do. Do you? What? She went out, Jake. What of Jess Mitchell's wife? Maybe she knows. Hey, pretty woman. You know who this pretty woman is? You're both pretty. You might as well know each other. That's some stupid ass advice. Almost feels like less of a superhero movie, more of like a murder mystery movie. Gabby, what's wrong? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow down. Slow down. I, okay. No, no. Stay, stay there. Wait for me, okay? Wait for me. I'm on my way home. Okay, we got someone following her. Well, I think we know who that is. Wait, that is her. Oh, that. Which one of these one? Which one of these girls is the one on the news? <gasps> what the hell? Okay, cat lady. Oh fuck, she's Catwoman. Is that Catwoman? We putting on some spandex. Okay, that's Catwoman. Okay, she's just rushing gymnasts off the building, like, right in the middle of the open. Whoa. Dude, I've always wanted some shit like that in my house. Trap doors, secret doors, bookcases that open up into different rooms. It'd be so sick. You're pretty good at that. Consuelo. Monica. He heard her. That's why you killed him. What? Oh, we're thinking Catwoman killed the damn mayor? Because the mayor hurt her friend? What does she know? Whatever it is, it's got her so spooked she won't even tell me. She did seem upset. Back at your place. Oh, that's the creepiest thing to say, man. Your new living room furniture looks really nice as well. Great taste. Ikea? 
Why were you outside my house? Hello, people of Gotham. This is the Riddler speaking. Here's another. We'll soon be losing Oh those. my god, no, dude. The guy's gonna get his face eaten by rats. The truth about our city will finally be unmasked. Goodbye. Wow. Close your fridge. Who leaves their fridge open? Jesus, she's got a lot of cats. You got a lot of cats. <laughs> what? Yo, Batman and I like this, bro. That was awesome. In my mind, I always think about him like, what happens if the Batman doesn't find these clues? Like, you just leave him elsewhere? He's got a lot of faith that he's gonna find them in these weird locations. In the shit tray underneath a cage? Follow the maze until you find the rat. Bring him into the light and you'll find where I'm at. The hell? Find where I'm at? Dude just ended a sentence with a preposition. His grammar's terrible. Well, I got you. Ow. Damn. I don't know. Putting contacts in with those long ass nails? How's that work? Are they gonna kiss? Looks good. Oh, okay. I thought they're. I thought shit was about to get a little hot and heavy in here. It's getting hot in here. It's so hot. So I don't go to clubs. I rarely go outside. Kenzie, William, he's an off duty cop. Looks like I broke his nose. <laughs> Deviated septum ass. City council. These guys have a little problem with eye contact, don't they? Feels good, doesn't it? <laughs> They're just staring at her tatas. Fucking disgusting animals. Fast access to a girl's boobs. Don't look at her boobs. Pro tip. You don't know what you're talking about. Look back. If I look back, it's gonna be a whole can of worms. I need to see his face. He's gonna be staring hard, isn't he? Oh God. That's the DA. And he's coming over, you happy? Hey there, I saw you looking. I'm Gil. Hey, aren't you the DA? Yeah. Wow, I've seen you on TV. Is that right? <laughs> this dude's got a three-quarter chub right now. Honey, I live on the edge. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Gil. Do you want to come over? No, Gil, pump the brakes, bro. Uh, Third is question Travis. is you- Oh, I meant to the, uh, he meant to the table. Thought he meant to his bed. I like this girl. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this Riddler, he's going after the most powerful people in this city. He knows so much. You need to ask him about the rat. Hey, what's this about a rat? <laughs> Dude, she's good. Get a little bit closer to his Willis and then ask what you want. Tell me your bank account information. What? There was a rat informant. We have big time information on Salvador Moroni. It's gonna come out. And when it does, this whole city's gonna come apart. Worst DA ever. I mean, you're a high as shit, I guess, but. Hey, been a long time since I've seen you down here. How you been? Don't caress her chin, freak. Don't be a stranger. You are a terrifyingly disgusting man. I feel like you smell like B.O. I feel like you're the type of dude to spray cologne over the B.O. So it just mixes and gets this disgusting fucking... Yeah, I gotta go. Oh, you need a ride? <laughs> dude, you're drunk as a skunk and fucking wasted more than Bon Jovi. I'll see you around. <laughs> Let's hope you can close cases a little bit better than you can close women. Just do your fucking job. I thought the Riddler was in that car. Oh shit, he is. Oh. Oh. What the hell did I just see? What do you know about a confidential informant in the Moroni case? Yeah, sure there was. That's the rap we're looking for. Gil's very nervous. Yeah, he's probably dead right now. You didn't tell me you had a relationship with him. I don't have a relationship with him. Pretty. You a new friend of yours? This version of Batman is just younger, darker, interesting casting call, dude. It's a public memorial for Mary Mitchell. Rather might not be able to resist. Rat a lot of rat with wings. A slang for pigeon. <laughs> rat with wings. Stool pigeon. I'm gonna start calling, ew, stool pigeon, fuck. I'm gonna start calling pigeons sky rats. I think it's a great casting call. I really do. We saw you yesterday. Oh, who's he with? Is he with her? Who the fuck is that? Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for coming to today's memorial for our beloved mayor, Don Mitchell Jr. 
Bruce Wayne, why haven't you called me back? Stop being so clingy. You really could be doing more for this city. As far as I can tell, you're not doing anything. Okay, how about you don't bug into my personal life? I could be doing a bunch of shit you don't know about. Gil Coulson is missing. What? She hasn't been heard from since last night. She hasn't heard from him. Oh, Jesus. Oh my God, what is happening? Gil's gonna be in there, isn't he? <gasps> There's a bomb around his bed! Oh, fuck. <laughs> Dude, y'all need to be getting out of the building. Holy shit. This is getting crazy, dude. Looks like a combination lock. Can we just cut it off? Can't you just cut it off? What the hell? Not if you want to keep your head. <gasps> okay, well... I think that's objective number one. In these trying times, never forget. I'm just a phone call away. I didn't even rhyme. Who are you? I've been trying to reach you. You're part of this too. Let's do it together, okay? <laughs> They're FaceTiming? What the hell? I've never seen a criminal choose porn star clear glasses like that. Oh, they're live right now? They're on Instagram or something? Fuck. Tell us which vermin you're paid to protect. Which vermin? The rat. The informant you all protect from the Salvatore Moroni case. How do you know about that? What's his name? 20 seconds. No. He's gonna kill you. Fucking say it, dude. Dude, you're gonna oh, die. Oh, <laughs> what do you mean? Stop. <laughs> Oh my god, that scene was intense. W would they not remove the mask? Hey! You have any idea what kind of trouble you're in? Dude, you're not intimidating at all with that raspy ass voice. You're gonna put yourself on the line for this scumbag, too? I gotta get you out of here. I'll put a lot of heat on you. Oh, you punched me in the face. He's a real one. Oh my god, dude. Were they, they would not be shooting inside like that. That is so reckless. Oh, shit. Dude, he's just flying, squirreling around. I mean, that beats splattering, but... Wow. The rata alata. The what? Like a stool pigeon. What the hell is a stool pigeon? I think of a pigeon covered in shit, covered in stool. I guess no one says stool, but... <laughs> Can you imagine? Excuse me, guys. Great food. If you'll pardon me, I have to stool. Looks like they got Maroney's operation up and running again. Why well, they never shut it down at all? What are you saying? Biggest drug bust in GCPD history was a fraud. Oh, what? Whoa. Dangerous crowd you're stealing from. Yeah. <gasps> hey, Benson! You think you can come after my money, huh? Smack him in the face. Literally just ram up and fucking jackknife kick him right in his- right in his balls. or someone affiliated with the mob with how crazy you are? Not a bad day. I guess, well, I don't know. Kind of a compliment in a weird sadistic way. Get out of the way! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Dear Jesus. Oh my god, yeah, perfect, bro. Yeah, just Mario Kart over everything. 
everything, dude. <laughs> you didn't do oh, shit, you. penguin. Stop stroking yourself. Psycho! I got you! <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, time to start shitting your pants. Dude, I'm not kidding. That may, oh my God. That may be one of like the most intense car chase wreck scenes I've, I've seen in a movie. That was super well done. A lot of angles that you don't normally see from a car accident. Wow. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Tell me he says something snarky. Okay. I guess that's probably why I don't write like super high stakes films because I would have said something like Does that Jasper size you? You work for them too. What are you crazy? That's why you killed the girl. I didn't kill no girl. Girl? You are El Rata Alada. You are El Rata that says that? Why? <laughs> World's greatest detectives. Am I the only one here knows the difference between Al and La? Jesus. You know what that sounds like to me? A friggin' bat. Huh? You ever take a that? Missing that big picture. I need to show you more for you to understand. My next victim is the biggest piece of the puzzle yet. Okay, who the hell's that? I don't know why I'm screaming, I'm sorry. Do you know what I am? Any idea? Yeah. What? Dude. He's an orphan. Oh. I must be dumb as a rock, because I don't know any of these. He's talking about the old orphanage. One that burned down. It was part of the Wayne estate. And they donated it. Oh, I remember that. You guys realize I'm still here, right? <laughs> Shut up. Hey, the little bits of tasteful comedy in here. That's nice. A good counterbalance to all the darkness and heaviness. <laughs> Shut up. Put your little Vienna sausage back in your pants. We're not untying you. Hey! Who the fuck are you? Oh God, they're drugged out. Drop it. What the hell is a drop? What is that? Are they talking like drop acid? Where it all began. Sins of the fuck. Oh. So Batman's getting the the heat from his father's mistake or whatever. Jesus, his next victim is Bruce Wayne. Wait, but in so, uh, he doesn't know that Bruce Wayne is Batman, does he? Oh my god, it's just gonna be who he loves? Do not tell me Alfred fucking dies. I haven't had as much of an emotional connection to Alfred in this movie, but it's fucking Alfred and Batman. You have to love him. Alfred, answer the phone. You're supposed to be the butler. You're supposed to answer the phone. No. Do not tell me he's gonna open that. Fireproof. <gasps> he's gonna set- he's gonna set the house on fire! Oh my god! Oh god, Alfred! Oh, that Oh my god! You should go home, Mr. Wayne, get some sleep. How can you sleep when something tragic like that happens? I guess it's either side of the coin. You either drown yourself in sleep, weird choice of words, or you don't sleep at all and you're up overthinking. Something about this version of Batman makes me feel like I can relate to him a little bit more. He's always been such like a detached entity in terms of how I feel connected to him. Not that I'm detached to him, I just I just couldn't really relate. I just relate a little bit more with this guy. Falcone owes me that money. He owes you. Yeah, and a lot more. No, really. Why is that? You know what? I can't even talk to you. No. Say it. Because he's my father. My mother worked at the 44 below. And your dad was fucking her? Wasn't ready for that. You assume the worst in people. Which, well. It's safe. You guys do that as well. I, I had like self-reflected the other day and I was like, I do think about the worst in people a lot. I think about the best in people a lot, giving them the benefit of the doubt, but also I just don't feel like I trust anybody. All anyone cares about in this place are these white privileged assholes. Why are they bleached? <laughs> I'll show you a little vengeance after. Okay. Are you guys gonna kiss or not? I'm more dangerous than you know. Oh. Yes. I told you, baby. Oh. 
I can take care of myself. Quick couple leaps right there in the relationship. First kiss and a pet name. The Waynes, 20 years ago, one reporter set out to uncover the dark truth. When Martha was just a child, her mother brutally murdered her father, then committed oh. suicide. Thomas Wayne tried to force this crusading reporter into a hush money agreement to save his mayoral campaign. But when the reporter refused, Wayne turned to longtime secret associate Carmine Falcone and had him murdered. The what? Yo, that added way more complexity to the story. Did you kill him for my father? Look, your father was in trouble. Your father tried to pay the guy off, but he wasn't going for it. Said, wow. Maroney was worried. He would have done anything to keep him from becoming mayor. You understand? Salvatore Maroney got my father killed. I'm just saying it sure looked that way to me. Fuck. <sighs> Robert Pattinson's doing a good job, like, portraying that emotion of finding that answer out right there. I mean, I get the logic for the Riddler, how he's like, the son must pay for the father's sins, but it's like, if you don't know Bruce Wayne's Batman, he's just some quiet, nerdy, pale dude sitting in his house all day long not bothering anybody. Like, why have him killed? You dumbass. You lied to me my whole life. About Salvatore Moroni. He told you Salvatore Moroni. Yeah, my father killed. Why didn't you tell me all this? He's gonna say to protect you or some bullshit like that. Your father was a good man. He made a mistake. A mistake? Get a man killed. I mean, that is kind of fucked up. At the same time, I see the argument for him not being all bad because he made one wrong choice. But it's murder. Fuck. But he never thought Falcone would kill that man. Your father should have known that Falcone would do anything to finally have something on him that he could use. He told Falcone he was going to the police, and that night, your father and your mother were killed. <sighs> what the fuck, man? If you're ever going through any of that again, I'm losing somebody I care about. That's a different type of pain. I've been there, man. My dad had to bounce. I haven't seen him since I was in sixth grade. Fucking bomb drop for you guys. But, like, when you lose someone, it's tough. Granted, death is a bit different, but an argument for it being pretty bad also if they're in the world and you just can't see them or they don't make an effort to i saw the signal that's not you i thought it was you well who the hell was it the damn riddler oh uh, it's our girl it's our girl let's go here listen Oh my god, that is so hard to hear. Recording of your friend being strangled to death? The falcon has wings too. Falcon is the rat. What? We work for him. Everybody does. What the hell does that mean? Falcon's mayor. He's been the mayor for the last 20 years. That is insane. Come on, vengeance. Holy shit! Don't that son of a bitch. Like, that's totally messed up, don't get me wrong, and it's a fucked up thing to do, but it is a well-executed plan. There's no other way. He owns the city. That is insane. Cross that line. You'll become just like him. Don't throw your life away. Don't worry, honey. I got nine of them. <laughs> oh, shit, that would be so scary for this dude. He, he, there would be shit rolling towards his face and down his face. Oh, no. And if she kills Falcone, we may never find the Riddler. I have to stop her. So the Riddler doesn't necessarily seem like the worst guy. I guess he's having people killed and shit, so he's a pretty bad guy. But he seems to want to just shed light on all the corruptness that's going on. I was just hoping I could talk to you for a minute. Absolutely. Does Falcone think he's going to get his Willis touched? Because that's not going to happen, dude. Only head she's going to touch is she'll touch you with the head of the gun. That was a terrible joke. That was a stupid joke. She's gonna shoot you, bro. No, that's okay. I have a tissue. Oh my god. Right here. Mr. Falcone. Vinny! Didn't I tell I'm you? Sorry, Mr. Falcone. I really think you're gonna wanna see this. Well, that dude walked in at the perfect second. Oh, that was a good setup. I got a tissue. <laughs> Bitch! Hey, Dad. <gasps> what? This is for my mother. Yes, he didn't. Oh my god, she missed? Oh my god. You can't miss. 
That was not a graceful run, dude. You don't, nobody runs quickly like that. <laughs> Just does not care at all, dude. That was a really cool scene. Cool shots right there, man. Oh, dude, she just squirrel slapped him on the table. Okay. You don't think this hurts me? Oh my God, he's gonna try to strangle her too? Oh God. That would like crush her throat. Where's Batman? You made me do this. <laughs> okay, all right. He has to pay! Well, if that's the truth, then he's so has done such grisly things. Like shooting him would almost be letting him off too easy. I mean, you like you could let her shoot him somewhere that it won't kill him. You shoot him in the dick. Compromise. I think that's fair. <laughs> you think you're gonna scare me with that mask and that cape? Let me tell you something. Whatever I know. Whatever I've done, it's all going with me to my grave. Sounds like a real mafia leader, dude. That's some crazy shit. Don't you know you boys in blue work for me? I guess we don't all work for you. Holy shit, that's a lot of cops. Every time I watch a Batman movie, I just ha envision him like putting his head down and fucking jabbing someone in the eyes with his spikes. Goddamn rat. You always just a gimp. In an empty suit. I'll spray paint your ass! What are you doing? I need shoot! I need shoot! Yeah, you're gonna get you for attempted murder, jackass. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... What do you say? I'm gonna graffiti your ass to the wall? I'll spray paint your ass! I'm gonna spray paint your ass? This is a weird way to say that. Could have said a lot of other things. That was a strange one. Bring him out to the light. And you'll find where I'm at. <laughs> Uh, dude, Bruce is like a fucking riddle savant. That dude looks like Stan Lee from a different dimension. He's gonna come from above. Oh. Lieutenant, we got a witness here, so she saw someone come down the fire escape, said he went into the corner, dying on. Right no, nah, he wouldn't be that sloppy. That chick was planted there or something. He knows. Or that's the wrong guy. It's the wrong fucking guy, probably. Please! Hands up! <laughs> oh, that dude's got the glasses though. The porn star glasses. I just sorted a slice of pumpkin pie. Okay, yeah, dude, you 100% got serial killer vibes. I just ordered some pumpkin pie. Would anybody like to have some? with me. It looks like they're putting something in your ass, dude. What are you making those faces for? He's super creepy. Okay. Yeah, that's super weird. Right now, take some time. We'll get in. Wait, what the fuck? Oh. Oh my god, he knows. I've been invisible my whole life. Now everybody knows that you're kind of a freak show. Very troubled child. Or man. It's a weird thing if you can't tell if the dude's a kid or a man. Bruce Wayne. How does he know? Bruce Wayne, the orphan. Mm. Looking down on everyone with all that money. There's the real root of the issue. Do you have a problem with the orphan situation or the money situation? It sounds like the money's way more of an issue. You and I both know. I'm looking at the real you right now. My mask allowed me to be myself completely. No shame. I had the answers, but I didn't know how to make them listen. You gave me that. I gave you nothing. Oh my God. This is like a super clingy ex-girlfriend type, or not even girlfriend, super clingy Tinder chick vibe. We're not together, but one time you winked at me. I, I was pregnant. What? You inspired me. You're out of your goddamn mind. Oh! We could watch the whole thing together. 
Watch what? Everything! What have you done? Come on, stay composed. He's just singing at you. Just relax. It's creepy as fuck. <sighs> Super unsettling, man. Honestly, what nightmares are made of right there? Fucking weird, greasy guy. A real change. What kind of weird, cryptic shit is that? I Parked seven vans all along the city seawall. They will go. Oh, Jesus. Super creepy. The flooding will happen so fast, evacuation will not be an option. Those who are not washed away. Oh my god, everybody's gonna be wiped out out there, man. And that's where all of you come in. They're gonna blow it up. It will be your turn. You'll be there waiting. Oh my god, they all have the porn star glasses. That is creepy as fuck, man. We can get everyone in. It's not safe for you here. We need to get you out, Miss Real. I'm not going anywhere. We're under attack, man. Exactly. Excuse me. <sighs> man. Bitch, you're gonna get shot, okay? For them to actually shoot him and it not be hit by something bulletproof, they'd have to literally shoot him like in the mouth, right? I'd imagine even the face part is bulletproof. <laughs> Using the gun as a bat. <laughs> oh shit. Where's Catwoman? She's gonna pop out, right? She's gotta save the day. Ain't nobody touching my man. Move, bitch! Let's go! Oh! Okay, yeah. Let's end up on top of each other. This is nice. Is that your- is that your chub? What? It's over. Wait. It's over. What happened to the flooding? <laughs> what are you moaning and groaning for? Get up! I guess he did just get shot with a fucking shotgun, but... This is gonna be his first fucking kill, dude. Take it easy. <laughs> what the hell is that? Stick him up! Put your hands down. Who the hell are you? Yeah, no shit. I'm vengeance. Vengeance? Oh, okay. There it is. I'd be so interested to see how they make this scene in the movies. That's such a cool scene. How do you even do that? Is it all CGI? What? What the hell? Why did that happen? Oh, wow. The mayor to be... Oh, the boy! Fuck the mayor! Okay. Yeah, that's better. I was like, what a weird... What a weird way to end this. Saves the boy. Yeah, okay. Alright, now the mayor. Come on, bitch. Oh, I should probably fucking turn this light on now that it's getting darker. Jesus. Get that a little bit better. Damn, that's bright. The city is underwater. <gasps> the dog! The National Guard is coming. Martial law is in effect. Oh, shit. Circles back to this heroin music. Things will get worse before they get better. Together, we will learn to believe in Gotham again. 
Oh my god. I'm starting to see now. You know, it's like an apocalypse, dude. Vengeance won't change the past. I have to become more. People need hope to know someone's out there for them. <laughs> fuck off, Riddler. Isn't that just terrible? Wait, who the fuck is talking now, dude? You're a clown. No way. You did so well. Wait, is this in his brain or is this the Joker talking? The less of them you have, the more one is worth. A friend. <laughs> it's gotta be the Joker. There's the laugh, man. And I just saw something on Instagram today that showed that the second part of this movie, the Batman, is coming out. So I guess it's going to be Joker and Riddler teamed up. It's awesome. You know this place is never going to change. There's going to be a power grab. It'll be bloody. I know. I have to try. It's going to kill you eventually. You know that. She's probably right. Why don't you come with me? Get into some trouble. Oh. The bat and the cat. <laughs> or put my bat in your cat. A terrible way to end the movie, that would be. She doesn't even know who Bruce Wayne is, though. Or she doesn't even know Batman is Bruce Wayne. Or Bruce Wayne is Batman, however the fuck you want to talk about it. Interesting, though, how we didn't... I guess we... Did we see the Batmobile? Is it technically the Batmobile we saw? That might have been the Batmobile, I don't know. Going their own separate ways. Some of the scenes in this movie dragged on just a little bit, like it was a little slow at parts, but this has been super interesting. <laughs> yeah! Dude, that was good. Definitely think it could have been condensed and, sh and shortened up a bit. And one of the things that I was most confused about was why he like didn't even call himself Batman. Like there was no Batman going on. Called himself Vengeance. So I, I don't know if it's like, that's what he did until the end of the movie and then realizes that vengeance is not the answer. It's not the thing to aim to be. So it's like pre-Batman, not necessarily sure, but that was fun, man. The thing that really struck me was Robert Pattinson's performance. Like I didn't know what the hell to expect. In my mind, to be honest, I was like, ah, oh, Twilight dude is Batman now? Like what the fuck? Very pleasantly surprised. I think that he did a great job. He was very emotional and moody and just like that, that Batman type. Sick, man. I'm not complaining about that. If I had to give that a score, I'd probably say that was, I give it, uh, 82%. What did, what did the score get? Rotten Tomatoes. 85%. Okay. So pretty spot on, dude. I just, I'm, I'm very interested to see where they go with the, with the next movie. That's going to be super cool. Um, now I don't necessarily know how the fuck Rotten Tomato scores work, but whatever. Doesn't, doesn't even matter. That was a damn journey, man. I want to say thank you guys so much for tuning in and watching this reaction with me. Really did enjoy that. Man, that was good. It's just a different take on Batman. Anyway. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. That's a uh, bye.